Hey, what's going on, everybody? Today we have the Fantastic Four set of five awesome looking movie toys released by Burger King back in 2005. Let's get them opened up and take a closer look. First up in the set is Dr. Doom. Check it out. This is a great representation of the Fantastic Four nemesis, the evil Dr. Doom. This is really nice. This is really cool. And again, with the shiny chrome plated face, that's kind of neat. And you can see he's got some clear hands right here. And that's because on the back, the gimmick is what you do is you take two fingers, your thumb, two fingers, uh, however you want to do it, just two points of contact here. Place them on here and check it out. It lights up. <laughs> And that is it. And he stands approximately four inches tall. There is no articulation whatsoever. Just solid plastic. But you know what? I kind of dig it. That is the invisible woman. Check it out. This is awesome. Who doesn't like clear plastic? It makes everything just so cool. So she's about the same height as Dr. Doom, four inches tall. But she's kind of bendy and soft plastic-like. So it doesn't really move anywhere. No points of movement. But she is kind of squishy. So you can see my Hulk mug, you know, the Hulk, that's because that's how I roll. I got the, the Hulk mug, what? And it's full of cold water. So what you do is take the Invisible Woman, you dip it into cold water just like so. And you hold it there for, I don't know, a few seconds. And let's see, come on. And it's filling. It's supposed, maybe it's because it's too old. I don't know if the toy is just too old. But this is like ice cold water. Anyway, what's supposed to happen is you put it put her in the cold water and she's supposed to turn blue like the, like her original blue outfit color but apparently this is a fail because it's just too old i think it just ran out of its mojo there's no more mojo toy mojo but anyway if it worked it'd be really awesome but it's not really awesome because it's not working so it's just kind of cool <laughs> and next up we have the human torch this is cool because it's red and red's my favorite color this is great so about four inches tall, just like the other two. Can rotate the arms all the way around. And that is it for movement. But on the back here, here is the gimmick. You flip the switch on, just like that. And you can see his chest lights up yellow. But even better, you lay him down like this, like he's flying along. And let's see if we can get it to do it. And his chest lights up yellow and red, but it's kind of, you can kind of make it out there. See how it's lighting up both lights, yellow and red? And then you hold them down like in a diving position, and it just stays on red. So you got like three different functions there with the light. That's pretty awesome. I like that. And uh, that is it. Flip the switch off when you're done. There you go. The Human Torch. Next up, we have Mr. Fantastic. Wow, that, that's a really good likeness from the guy in the movie. That's just, that's just too awesome right there. That's really neat. So it looks like he has three points of movement here in his upper torso. But it actually just wiggles around. It doesn't really spin. It feels like you're going to break it if you force it too much. But that's all right. So he comes in four pieces here. And what you do is you take this piece here. And you peg it onto one of these sections. Just like this. Then you take this one here. And you peg it on. You can see the little tabs and stuff right there. And there you go. And then you take the two pieces just like so. And there you go. Check it out. So you got this... His legs right here, it's actually swivel back and forth. And he got this long section here, and it kind of makes him look like, well, he broke in half. <laughs> no, come on, stay on there. There we go. So what you do is you have him out here just like so. Now it looks like he's stretched way out there just to say hi. How you doing? And you can kind of pose him and wiggle him back and forth a little bit and spin him. And, well, this is actually kind of creepy. So you can shorten it up. You don't have to use all the pieces. You can take one out in the middle. And then peg it back on just like so and then shorten them up a little bit and well there you go <laughs> this is kind of cool i like it really neat stuff and last up we have the thing <laughs> this is probably the coolest one out of the whole set check it out so you got the thing sitting on this giant rock looking thing and you got the number four button for the fantastic force so you got this button you push it in so check this out <laughs> this is making me giggle ready so he's clapping, and it's supposed to be like this smashing sound, but it, you can clearly tell it's like a little spring of wire inside there. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I don't know. I could do this all day. <laughs> so there you have it, everybody. The Fantastic Four set of five pretty cool toys, except for Mrs. Fantastic, because she didn't work. Released by Burger King back in 2005. These are actually really neat to have if you're into Marvel and you like the Fantastic Four. You're absolutely going to want to collect this set for sure. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. We'll see you next time.